Uh, acorns is a traditional food. You know, if it's a traditional food, it should be a staple. You know, and the only way it can be a staple is that we have to begin to develop it within our homes and make it that staple. Okay, yeah. we're having acorns today. Okay, we're having acorns today. Oh, we're having acorns and fish today. Oh, okay. we're having acorns and berries today. We're having acorns and clear meat today. We're having, you know, it was that. That was how it was. Once you've done that process of looking at and examining every single acorn that you have in your box or that you gathered, then you would put them in a flat shallow box. Set it in the inside right here. I'm gonna just crack your acorn right open. Once you crack your acorn and it's dried properly, like I said, these ones we didn't take very good care of. There's this outer skin that's around your acorn and it's like a sleeve that, that covers the nut inside of your shell. You want to get rid of that. If your acorns are dried perfectly, if they are where you want them to be, ideally that sleeve is just going to slip right off. It's not going to be something that you have to cut off, peel off. Um, this one right here, I believe, is a flower grinder, and you just put it in and put your acorns in, and then the, all the powder just comes out right here. It's milled right out. So the longer the age of your acorn and that you take care of it in that good way, um, the better the taste, the better the quality is. It's and then we'll pour water over top of them and it just drains out. And it drains all the way through the acorns. That's the leaching process. You take your powder and you just throw it all in there. Now this is a quart. This is what we came up with. This is gonna turn into over a gallon of acorn soup. But if you can get pur purified water, that's what you want to put on your acorns. You don't want to put tap water on there while you're leaching it. You want to put purified water on there. Or like, you know, if you have like a local stream or something that, um, like a spring that you can put your acorns under, that's ideal. Basically what you want to do is you want to slowly pour your water over top of your acorns and try to get all of them 